Welcome to Capitan Morgan's War Games. I am a member of the Iggy Beers 40k War Gamers Unification Group on Facebook. I'll pop a link in the description below. This is the place to get your fix of anything 40k related. Right. Coming right up is a 2k battle report between Orcs and the Thousand Sons. Uh, my daughter Jasmine is playing my Thousand Sons at least, uh, and I'm playing the Orcs. We're playing on the Maelstrom of War mission, and as you can see, we have deployed, placed the objectives. Uh, you, you, using my tactical, uh, from my tactical video, you'll see well, what, how I place mine, and Jazz has just placed hers any way she wanted. But this uh, will show what I mean in good stead. Now, this is my Thousand Sons army. You've got a 30 man squad as Engels, a 10 man squad, 10 man squad, three, and two demon princes in the battalion. Then you've got a spearhead with or vanguard sorry with three so uh three decimators of salt hole petards the uh Araman on the disc and the super heavy with magnus uh my orc list is pretty straightforward triple battalion uh first battalion is Two weird boys. And 30, 30 boys, 29 boys on the knob, 29 boys on the knob with a power claw, 29 boys, and the other rest, 15 boys. And, uh, Uh, then the second battalion is, which of course will be uh, bare bones, is the two shock attack guns, and a big mix of them. One, the super, the shock attack gun, and then three, three units of 20 Gretchen. And my last one is from the uh, New Psychic Awakening, which is the... Uh, Going to be the uh, Grot, Grot one. And in that I've got a big mech Grot Oiler and Weird Boy as my HQ. All the Weird Boys have got, two of the Weird Boys have got um, Warp Head. And then I've got two units of four mech guns and three units of ten Grots. To make up the battalion, uh, my these boys here are going to be in reserve. Now, what I wanted to do just before is I've deployed as if I was facing a gun line, and the way I would deploy in lines, so that I'll spread out slowly across the board in long thin lines. Uh, the decimators are only, and they've only got 24 inches, so they, they won't be able to reach much in shooting wise. And I, I should be able to sit back, control the board, and slowly move out and win the game. Jazz, on the other hand, again, is would do similar. Uh, but she's got to sit back because she hasn't got the numbers to counter me in this. Jasmine's all the Thousand Sons movement phase, not much has moved. <laughs> all we're going to do is cast a few buffs on their psychic powers uh, to keep them on Magnus. And then these have moved up to get their kill because Jasmine's... Uh, Three of those, 
and what am I going to do? I'm going to, I'm going to make her that one. She gets double points if she achieves by the, within a couple, couple turns. So we get on to the psychic phase for Thousand Suns. Psychic phase over Jasmine. You cast Glamour and uh, Weavers of Fate on Magnus. He's got a three up in ball and it's hard to hit, which means minus one to, to hit him at range. Uh, and that was it. On to the shooting. She's only got one set of shooting, which is from the three decimators. We'll come back straight after them. Uh, wipe out two uh, unit of ten Gretchen, fail to wipe out the second unit of uh, Gretchen, cause a more wound on themselves. My Gretchen will need to, second unit will need to make up. I will spend two command points, taking me down to ten command points to autumn pass morale, and it will be. Orc turn one. Uh, get the Thousand Suns scored two points. Three points this turn. So we'll use this dice as your score marker. She attains the defend objective four, which she's on already. So uh, by the end of her turn, then she'll score, score uh, maximum points for a turn. Right, right. So I'm. Uh, Moved up to the centre of the board for area of denial, which I believe I've got uh, nothing within six inches of, of the board. Oh no, I've got no prisoners this time, so but I've moved up, I'm moving my uh, screen out. Uh, I've got secure objective one and defend objective six, which I, I'm on, and no prisoners. Uh, so I've moved that with that in mind. Uh, <coughs> I, I've also did jump to these orcs over here just for a moment, just to give, them, give me a bit of breathing space. What I'm going into next is my. Uh, I did my uh, psychic phase and did jump them uh, as well. So we're going into my shooting phase. We'll come back straight after orc shooting phase turn one. So I'll get two shots. I need four pluses, one's one hit, toughness is, is it seven or eight? I don't know what it's I've got to equal the toughness to wound it, all right? I believe it's toughness seven, but. Seven yet, so I need seven more, seven or more on the dice to wound, which I do. You get a five up in roll save, you don't make, so it takes this many wounds, it takes four wounds, puts it down to three. Second one, same target. Gets two shots. Gets one, one hit. Need seven or more. It does. So you get another five up. Don't save. I need three or more for it to die. I'll get a three. You, it doesn't explode. Oh, roll a d6 to see if it explodes actually. 
No, it doesn't expose that that model was dead. They're not so recording. Just gotta see if I can reach yeah, the third one. Can I start recording? In the auction one and all my firepower went into the uh, decimators and I, I killed all three decimators that's uh, using more daka daka and uh, on the looters to, to to finish it finish it off she did extremely well she, she, it had six rooms left, and I, I put got four. I got thirteen mm, through, through and she saved ten, and she saved ten of them. But of course, it's not six to seven. But it's uh, there wasn't quite enough to save her. Uh, so. I scored, I scored three points, same as Jazz's turn. We're going into Thousand t Sun's turn. So Two Thousand Sun's moved up. Mazengal's there, and to a bit there. Uh, Magnus and Demon Princes and Araman set off a load of psychic powers, scoring a point for them uh, on psychic supremacy. They did a hell of a lot of damage to my orc boys that were here and um, with with, char with charges and in the fight phase they managed to reduce me to three and I did breaking heads and rolled a six on the uh, D3 which got rid of the last three so that was unit for no prisoners uh, and defend objective four which he had School, which was a bonus point for her, puts her on uh, eight points to three to the Thousand Suns. Walk turn two coming straight up. Magnus died to all my shooting. Uh, these guys hung in by the skin of their teeth. And they're still there, so tying me up. Uh, but I've still got these to come in, so uh, I'm doing. So I've got scored. Hold the line, and overwhelming firepower. I needed that unit to die to really turn the screw, but. So I'm now up to five. It's uh, Thousand Suns turn three, and we'll see w what happens there. Thousand Suns moved up. <laughs> a lot of psychic powers into here with the combat. They got rid of those boys. Those singles got rid of the Gretchen that were there, and that unit stayed put at the moment. Uh, I've still got a lot I can do and I'm planning to get that done. Bring those boys up here. Well, or over here, actually. Uh, to jump over there. And shoot, shoot what I can here. Shoot these characters and bits here. here. Might smite if I can, but I probably won't. I'd probably just do what I need to do. Shooting wise, walk turn three. Points will be thousand suns this term. Ritual Slaughter. If nine enemy models were destroyed during the turn, which it was easily, score D3 victory points if at least one enemy unit was destroyed during the psychic phase. It was. Yeah. 
So that's three, four, four, and one during the divide by, which it was. So, so that's one, four, five. So four onto that makes 12. You are now 12, 13 points to five, but uh, all turn three, and this is where I have to start putting on the pressure. Right, just all but one survived there. The Sengals there died. The Prince moved over there. That Prince moved to there. And schools wise, it's 17 to seven. But Jazz knows she's gonna score that. She's got that. And she should get that. So, orc uh, thousand suns turn four. Orcs turn four, and uh, I've got the thousand suns. So it's just now me just playing out a game to see if I can catch as the the thousand suns on points. Uh, orc turn five. I've moved to grab those two objectives. Moved to grab those two objectives. I can troll six objectives. Uh, Current score is 20, 24. 24 to 16. Jazz, can you roll the dice to see if we go on another turn? We do go on another turn. So the game ends turn seven. And I, I, I scored another five points. Unfortunately, I lost by one point because Jez had 24, I had 23. I just didn't get the cards towards the end of the game that I, I required to to win. But as you can see, I mean, I had ball control for most of the game. Uh, it was just, I had to allow her to come on to me and soak up a bit of pressure before Yeah, in anywhere, but I am very happy with that result. It wasn't. It was. I just couldn't get cards that I needed, uh, and when I I, I needed, a, I rolled a one on the D D three, uh, which put me behind. If I really well, if I if I'd been able to roll higher there, I would have possibly won. That's the way it goes. Well done, Jez. Well played. Your first win against me as well. Playing, but playing my thousand sons, that was quite a thing. I did wipe you uh, turn four, I think, but give me three turns to try and catch you. But with the new way new missions played, it meant you still won because you accrued the point, more points. Thank you for watching. If you've been have enjoyed, please hit the like button, press the subscribe button and hit the bell button to stay up to date with all my content. Also feel free to share anything you've enjoyed. Remember, everybody knows the dice are loaded.